Hey everyone, Justin with 702pros.com here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a custom button to your menu in WordPress. All right, I'm going to get started with the screencast. Just follow along, and um, I have notes at the bottom. If you have any comments or questions, please ask me in the comments. And also, I'm going to have my email if you want to request another video or if you want some elaboration on this video. Just let me know. Okay, screencast starting now. Okay, here we are. So we want to add a custom button similar to this one to the menu. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. So the first thing you're going to do is go to menus in the top tab. You have to be logged in to do that. And then go to custom links. Select that option. And then the first thing you're going to put in is the URL that you want the button to go to. And that can be a page, a post, it can even be another website. And then the next thing after you put in the URL is the link text. So this is the text that's going to display inside of the button. Once you put that in, go to add to menu. Once you see it populate down here, go to save menu. And then let's take a look at the front page once you save that. Refresh. Once you refresh the page, you're going to see the text here. But as you can see, the button's not here. So in order to do that, we want our button to look like this one down here. We're going to right click this button, then left click inspect. Now we can see what makes that button that button. So we have an open tag that says button, <laughs> and then we have a close tag at the end that says button. Now we need to put that into our uh, text on the menu in order to, or for it to look like that. So we're going to put that in here. So we're going to do an open tag of button and a close tag of button. And that should display the same exact button that we're seeing down there. So we're gonna go to the front end, save the menu, refresh the page, and voila, we got the button there. So say you didn't like the style of the, the current button on your website, you could put an inline CSS and change the style. And if you want a video on that, please leave a comment at the bottom or look for my email and you can send me an email with a request.